Hi boys and girls, it's Miss Spillers. This week we've been talking about dinosaurs and I have a dinosaur book for you today. This book is called Tiny T-Rex and the Impossible Hug. <clears throat> Hello Pointy, are you okay? No, today I feel sad. I do not want to play. I have tiny arms. It is very difficult to hug with tiny arms. Each day, I am growing taller, but my arms are still tiny. Hugging almost seems impossible for a Rex as tiny as me, but I will try anyway. Pointy needs me. Where is my father? I will ask him for advice. Hello, father. Rexes are thinkers, not huggers. Perhaps instead of hugs, mathematics might be the answer to your problem. Pointy does not like math. Math will only let make Pointy feel worse. Hello, Auntie Junip. I have a problem. I must learn how to hug, but my arms are too tiny. I have found that balance is the key to every problem. Balance and freshly squeezed cucumber juice. Do you like cucumber juice? Doesn't sound good to me. That is disgusting. I will ask my mother for help instead. He didn't think cucumber juice sounded good either. I have fallen and now I am lost. I do not think I will find my mother in here. Hello, mother. It's okay if you can't hug Tiny. You are good at many other things. You are kind and creative and braver than most. You are tiny but your heart is big. I cannot hug with my heart, mother. I must learn to hug with my arms. Hello, sister. Hello, brother. Please help me. Hugging is very difficult. We'd love to help, Tiny. To do the impossible, you must plan and practice. Practice, practice, practice. Thank you, Trixie and Ronnie. That is good advice. I will plan my strategy. So look, now he's trying to figure out how he's going to do it. He's making a plan. I will get stronger. I will practice very hard. I will practice my hugs on everything. Look at all the things he's going to try hugging. I will practice on I will not practice on that anymore. Do you know what that is? It's a cactus and it's very prickly and he tried hugging it, but it didn't feel too good. So he learned a lesson. I am almost ready. I will practice one more time. When I am done, I will find my friend. This tree is very big, like pointy. I will hug it. This is not a tree. I have made mistakes. Please help. From up here, everything looks tiny like me. I could hug anything I wanted. Now I am falling. I should not have let go. Now I will never find Pointy. Look, he fell down. He's falling. Hello, Pointy. Hello, Tiny. Look where he fell. He fell right on top of Pointy's head. I am here to make you feel better. I have practiced very hard and hugged many things. My arms are still tiny and my hugs are still tiny, but I will do my very best because you are my very best friend. Thank you, Tiny. Was Tiny able to hug Pointy after all that practice? That was the biggest hug ever. 
So he was able to use his tiny arms and give his friend a big giant hug. Boys and girls, I miss you all, and I wish I could give all of you a hug. Find somebody today that you love very much and give them a big hug. Bye. See you later.